clean the complex which is containing both anion and cation. The both are anionic and cationic complex. How to name this? See, I am teaching you by comparing these two. First thing here, which is which is first given will be cation, cation complex, and whichever will be the next one is anion. Here also, which is first given will be cation. And this is will be anion. So what is cation means? This complex totally will have the charge positive, and this complex will have totally charge negative. Here this will be having a positive charge, and this will be having a negative charge. See in this case, what we have to name? The first thing is name in first you have to go from left to right. You have to name the cationic complex first and then the anion. In the cationic complex, you have to name the ligand. You have to give number and name the ligand. See here, you have two ligands. One is Cl, another one is NH2. What is Cl? Cl is chlorido. It is chlorido. And what is NH3? NH3 is amine. How many you have uh, chlorido? You have two, so it will be di. Amine, how much you will be having? It is four, it is tetra. While naming the ligand, you have to name in the alphabetical order. See, you have to consider the name of the ligand, not the prefix used. You should not see di or t, d or t. You have to see the name of the ligand, that is C and A. Which will come first? A will come first. So, what is the name of the ligand here? It is tetraamine dichlorido. So, this is the name of the ligand. Next thing, what you have to do? Here also, what is the name, number and name the ligand? What is the ligand here present here? It is Pyridin. PY is pyridine. What is pyridine? Pyridine means C5H5N is pyridine. C5H5N is pyridine. How much you have? You have 4. So, what is the name of the ligand here? It is tetra pyridine. Next one. You have to name the central atom. Name the central atom, which is the central atom present here. It is platinum. Here it is a cationic complex. You have to name as such. As such platinum. If it is an anionic complex, you have to add the suffix in. Here also what is the complex? It is Platinum. So, it, uh, the name of the central metal atom is platinum. The next thing is calculate the oxidation state. Oxidation state of what? The central atom. So, how to calculate the oxidation state of the central atom? See here. First, you have to consider First, you have to see the coordination number of these complexes. See, in this first cationic complex, what is the coordination co number? Platinum. In the cationic complex, the coordination number is 6, right? Because you have 2 Cl and 4 in the 3, it is 6. Here in the anionic complex, anionic complex, platinum is having the coordination number, what? 4. So, you have a different coordination number. What you have to do in this case? You cannot take an average or anything else in this case. What you have to do? We know that this complex is cation, which is a cation which is first coming. This is cation. That means the charge should be positive here. And this should be anions means the charge should be a negative here. We know that platinum is having two oxidation states only. Only it is having plus two and plus four oxidation states only. 
first if you put plus 2 in the in this complex that means if you put this is plus 2 means this is what minus 2 right this will be 0 plus 2 and minus 2 totally the charge will be 0 so plus 2 will not come See here, you have to get a positive charge. If you put plus 2 for platinum, what happens? Chlorine is having minus 2 charge. And amine is having 0. It is a neutral ligand. Totally plus 2 and minus 2 will become 0. So, we should not put plus 2 here. What you have to do? Put plus 4. If it is plus 4, then this is minus 2. Totally the charge on the complex will be plus 2. It is 2 plus. So, this is a cationic complex. If it is plus 4, if you are putting here also plus 4 means what happens? Plus 4 and minus 4, it will become 0. So, plus 4 will not come here. What you have to do? You have to put plus 2 here. It is plus 2 and this is minus 4. So, totally the charge on the complex will be minus 2. This is 2 plus and this is 2 minus and totally neutral. So, what is the oxidation state of platinum here? The oxidation state of platinum here is 4. And the fourth one is, you have to go to the anionic complex. In the anionic complex, first what you have to do, you have to number and name ligand. So, what is the ligand present here? It is Cl. It will be chlorido and you have 4. So, it is tetrachlorido. It is tetrachlorido. Next, next step is calculate the or name the cation or name the central atom present here. Not cation, name the central atom. What is the central atom? It is platinum, but it is an anionic complex. Anionic complex means what you have to do? It should end with the suffix eight. So, it will be platinate. And the last step is calculate the oxidation state. Oxidation state of what? This platinum. We already calculated it is 2. Finally, what is the name of this complex? You have to write in the bracket. What is the name of the complex? It is tetra. Tetramine dichlorido platinum four and tetra chlorido platinate two. So this is the name of this complex. Now, coming to this complex, what is this? Naming the cation first, you number and you gave the number and name of the ligand. Next, you name the central atom, it is platinum. Calculating the oxidation state. See here the coordination number, it is 4 and it is also 4. In this case, you just take it as x. See here, x plus pyridyl. Pyridin, see you have no charge, only lone pair of electrons. So, the it is a neutral complex. And this, this platinum also, you take it as X. So, when you, are, when you have to take it as equally X means, it should have the equal coordination number. Here it is having the coordination number is 6 here and its coordination number is 4 here. Here you have to do like this. Here just to take it as X. Plus, chlorine is 4 into minus 1 is equal to 0. So, x plus x is 2x minus 4 is equal to 0. x is equal to plus 2. So, here also it is in what uh, oxidation state? Plus 2 oxidation state. Here also it is in plus 2 oxidation state. The oxidation state of platinum here is 2. So, calculate if it is plus 2. And it is 0 means that the complex will be having 2 plus. Here it is plus 2 and it is minus 4 means the complex is having 2 minus. So, 2 plus and 2 minus it is a neutral complex. Then what is the next step? Number and name the ligand present in the anionic complex. What is in the anionic complex? It is tetra 
you have four chloride so it is tetra chlorido tetra chlorido next name the central atom what is the central atom it is platinate why at is added because it is a anionic complex and oxidation state oxidation state here is 2 finally what is the name of the complex it is tetra pyridine platinum 2 tetra chlorido Platinate 2. So, this is the name of the complex. Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel for more videos.